Los Angeles has a little lamb, little lamb, little lamb. Los Angeles has a little lamb who's going to get their ass kicked. Hey, hey. What is up, DC Nation? I'm back with another Redskins video. Week 2 hype video. Redskins versus the Los Angeles Rams. Yes, the Los Angeles Rams. They moved out of St. Louis and they're back in Los Angeles just like old times. And it's, it's been a while since we've been in Los Angeles. Like, I, I don't know when the Rams moved to St. Louis, but, you know. Anyway, so, previous video was a Crow video congratulating the uh, Philadelphia Shingles for beating us. And this week, we're going up against the Rams. Alright, a team who won last week, 46-9, to against a terrible Indianapolis Colts team who has been garbage for the last two years. So, I'm not really worried about this matchup, you know. Now, the next two games after this matchup, I'm going to be worried because after, after this game, you know, we're going to have a pretty hard schedule for the next, like, month or so. But, <clears throat> or the next two weeks before I think we'll probably win again. But... Anyway, the Rams, last time we went up against these guys, the second game of the season was a couple years ago. Uh, we were playing in Landover, and we ended up winning because of our run game. Uh, this, this year around, we're in Los Angeles, and I, I don't think it's going to be the run game that's going to beat the Rams. I think Cousins is going to get his shit together because after that, after that performance he put on last week, you know, he's already – got a lot of hatred, you know, from fans saying the way he played was terrible, which he did, you know, it, it was terrible. So, obviously, expect him to be better this game. Um, the Rams, I don't know if I made a video about this before on this channel. I don't think I'd, I, I have, but the thing with the Rams is that they're a bipolar team. They... They're good one week, and then they're trash one week, and, you know, and it's been like that for, like, the last, I don't know, the last 12 years or something, you know. Right after uh, Marshall Falk retired, the Rams have been just one of those bipolar teams. You don't know what Ram team you're going to get, whether whether the good Rams team shows up or the bad team, Rams team shows up. But uh, last week, you know, the good Rams showed up, but like I said, they went up against – the Colts, who the only player they have on their team that's really worth a damn is Andrew Luck. And Andrew Luck wants to leave the Colts because, you know, if if you're the only p good player on a team, you know, you don't want to stay with that team. You know, I mean, that that's kind of what happened with Terrell Pryor Sr. because Terrell Pryor was the only um, – the only good player on the Browns, and so, you know, now he's with us. You know, Andrew Luck, you know, I, I don't expect him to be on the Colts next year, but we'll see what goes on with him. But, yeah, like I said, the Colts and the Rams last week, that really – with with the Rams scoring 46 to 9, that, that doesn't just surprise me at all because the Colts have been trashed for the last two years and – I'm not afraid of this matchup, but anyway, you know, that that's why I'm not afraid of the Rams, and even if the good Rams team does show up, you know, we got this game, you know, we're looking to even up our record at one and one, so anyway, I'll catch you guys uh, Monday, you know, go Redskins, beat the Rams.